Just clear it out and I can lure. No major, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Here I was thinking I was going to give y'all like bohemian, Bayesian tan. I don't know if y'all can really get into that. But guess what? We're heading back to the airport. Y'all probably be like, for what? Because I didn't even tell y'all. When we landed from Barbados, which was literally two hours later because I didn't get home until 3 a.m. Flight was supposed to land at 12... 30, we ended up landing a little after 1.30. My bags got lost. They had to get delivered to me. They tried to have them delivered that. Yeah, they tried to have them delivered to me today. But due to the fact that I'm leaving out again today, that was not going to work. So I had to go through a whole process that resulted in me getting home at 3 a.m. with no bags, but getting them delivered the next day. Um, but we're on the way back to the airport and it's a big deal. First of all, let's start with I'm checking off my 20th state today. And not only am I doing that, but the reason, like the purpose I'm going, the purpose of this trip in its entirety is just like when I got the news, I was at the airport getting ready to leave for Barbados and um, I cried. I cried so hard and happy tears at that and I deserve that like I can't remember the last time I had cried happy tears so the time has finally come I've been very quiet about it don't nobody know about it except the people that know about it and I mean that's really slim to none so it's time for me to get to the airport and y'all gonna see where we're going Ooh. all right guys so I have made it to the airport I dropped my bags off at sky priority fingers crossed everything gets where it needs to be on time if not, at least I have my makeup stuff in this bag here. And now, security is looking absolutely crazy. So, let me figure my way out through here. Who child, thank God I didn't get here any later because I would have really been pushing it. So crucially important to pay attention at the airport because I was this close to missing my flight because I was running my mouth, but nevertheless we made it. So I will see y'all when we land. shameless, on me decorated. All this got me feeling jaded. Hold up, hold up, I'll be waiting. Bad thing on my radar. Told me that I'm in a playlist. Flower bomb, she a lotus. I be thinking that I'm famous. I remember when I prayed for this. No sleep, cause I'm anxious. All this shit for entertainment. Crazy thinking that it's day one. All this business for the taking. Yeah. Hold it down for the nameless. Yeah. Oh yeah. I've been on a grind, yeah. Like I'm really on the rails. Like my life is on the line, yeah. guys so i have landed at the destination i am in a totally foreign airport never been here before um so i'm about to go grab my bags luckily i just got off the phone with my transportation so they're already here and waiting for me so i won't have to look for anyone really they need to look for me i'm so excited and nervous i said a big prayer on the flight y'all still don't know where we at or why we're here so who wants to head to my vlog uh, <laughs> This is my guy, guys. He's gonna be making sure we get from point A to point B safely. We have all bags, and yeah. Okay guys, it is, it is 
8.45. I am clearly in the bed. Um, I haven't even told y'all where we are yet, but I will let you all know that we are in Oregon. This is my 20th state that I visited and y'all probably like, what are you even doing in Oregon, girl? Like, what are you doing in Portland? And tomorrow, tomorrow will be the answer to all questions. I'm just so extremely blessed and excited to be in this place and to be able to take y'all with me. So good night. We have the biggest day tomorrow. Hey, Glammies. I'm back in another black truck with my client, Barb. Isn't she gorgeous? I just beat Hi. that face. Get into Hi. it. Curls for the girls. Yes. And yeah, guys, so I still haven't told you what we're doing today, but I don't really have to do too much talking because you're going to see it with your own eyes. So just stick with me, spend the day, and yeah, we outside. This is where I'm gonna be doing makeup today. What? Y'all, I am, it's, everything is feeling so surreal. Um, I am freaking speechless. I am literally standing on Nike's campus. I can't even hold it anymore because I'm literally fighting back my tears. I am in total shock and disbelief and gratitude. A view? I'm sick. Like, this is insane. Let's look at this right here. You see the name, period. And then we're gonna have food, snacks, another black queen. Let's get into her face, y'all, because <laughs> I did that. <laughs> I did that. Isn't she gorge? Yes. Single to all my NFL subscribe people. Get at her, okay? Like, I'm just cannot believe, you know, nothing. Just literally walking around in the Serena Williams building. I think this is the tallest building in Oregon and it's the only building named after a female. So, like, it's literally insane. The views are insane. So now I'm waiting on Miss Knowles to get here so I can be her face. The woman who made it all possible. This is he gorge. And then another black queen. Hi. Who misses Atlanta bad, but it's all so good. Bad. <laughs> now we're trying to be proud um, today, and those are the fire collections from last year. This oh, year. this is the shoes. Mm -hmm. this, this year, that's Let's the last see, year. Uh, I have a little joke. Please join me, Nike teammates, in giving an incredibly audacious welcome to Miss <laughs> Tina Knowles Lock. <laughs> Got everybody it's cozy okay i had to come on the balcony you guys because what these views are literally insane like i've never seen anything like this ever so guys apparently this is lake nike over here and drake did his video over here ah! All right, guys, so I'm here with, look at my new family. Just look at us. <laughs> hey, cousin. Hi. <laughs> and now it is time to go to the Nike store. I have never been to the Nike store. Y'all know this is already my first time being here in Portland all together. I think I'm still taking everything in. I can't even fully tell y'all all that I'm feeling because I'm trying to be present as well. Ask me tomorrow. And I would like to pass the camera to a legendary. I thought they were very appropriate. Galveston. 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 The legendary Galveston, Texas. Hero. Historian Sam Collins here with you. Juneteenth is the birthplace. Are we getting up? No. 
Galveston is the birthplace of Juneteenth. Just so glad to be able to share a little history with you. And so glad to be here in Portland, Oregon with all these wonderful people Ooh. in the elevator. Mr. Stokes, you sent me a list, guys, of must read so we can do our own educating because y'all know they like to rewrite history and it's not always true. So look, get into it. I'm going to post the list, link below, so y'all can read up. Up. You saying what's <laughs> up? Period. That's right. Oh, we've had an amazing day. Amazing. Amazing day. Everyone has been so informed today. So informed. And the best way to celebrate a good day is to shop. Don't care what nobody. That's how you end every day. That's how you end every day. You know what I'm saying? Look, this is what wealth looks like. This, this is what Juneteenth <laughs> celebration looks like. This is what it looks like. Look like. Look like. 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 This is the Tiger Woods building. Okay. Get into it. Main entrance is over here, but we're not going inside today. <laughs> Not, not today. We today, we shop. My name is Asia Spade. I'm your National Miss Juneteenth. And Juneteenth is so important to me because it is me. It's my history. It's who I am. It's the reason I am the way I am today. Um, it's my Independence Day. It's the day that we were freed from slavery, but we still go through modern day slavery. What is up, Glammies? It is, what time is it? 6.06. I have posted my little um, video finally on TikTok of me and Miss Tina knows and the girls are <coughs> eating it up and I love that. What I can appreciate about my TikTok community is when I post something like reading the comments because I really haven't had time to respond to everything. The comments have been so emotional for me obviously y'all saw yesterday because i just put clips in from the field day which was the big closeout so today is my actual free day in portland um i just kind of been exploring around i didn't vlog earlier i was just walking around um i stopped by the mall again i didn't get anything because it's just not giving what i needed to give but i am going to link up with one of my team members associates whatever you want to call them i met them at the festival i 
meeting a lot of people and like I told y'all before, when I travel, I like to stay in contact with the people who I meet because you just never know. You just never know. So we're about to go explore Portland. Um, there's this obvious, there's supposed to be this like Thai restaurant that I just am not supposed to ever leave here without. So we're going to check that out and see what it's talking about. Let's go. So yesterday I told Amari I was a foodie and I told him what I liked and he said he's gonna pick a spot, right? So this is where we're, we're going to his, this is his doing, okay? Legend has it, haha, that this is, oh, this is only on the west coast. I'm not gonna find it back home. Check one, cause you know I don't wanna eat anywhere that I could find back home anyway. Two, this is only one of two locations. One of which, so we're here in Portland obviously. And then the other one is in Cali? You say it right? I think it's in LA, yeah. LA. It's in LA. I'm vlogging and walking and crossing the street. How good am I at that, you know? Multitasking. Multitasking at its finest. So let's see. You guys, I am, um, this is the first, actually, this is the first time I'm even ever doing this. I'm putting my total in this man's name. Hello. Hey, welcome in Farmhouse, guys. I'll be your service today. I'm going to give you guys a service card. Let me know, okay? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, actually, these are always the greatest. Yeah, you know, do you want? Yeah, so. Don't ask me anything. That's okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's. We're going to start with. He's ordering everything for us, guys. So, let's see. Uh, so, we have two. Uh, Y'all, look at this. It's so cute. Okay. You doing good, we're off to a good start. We are off to an amazing start. Okay, now show me how you're gonna do things. All right, so, I haven't had this before, but <laughs> I guess. Okay. You should probably take a bite out. These flowers are edible, look at this. Literally. Look at you. <laughs> take a bite out. Okay. Are you dropping your butterflies? It's all good. Piece of it. Ooh, look at that! And it's coloring, you know? Yeah. So cute. Okay, Pinky. <laughs> you so elegant. That's hard. Yeah? Okay, okay, okay. See, I, I put all my cotton candy in mine. Hey, hi. I'm gonna eat my flower. <laughs> Did you eat the flower? I did. So that's what they do. That was a dish. I think it's a Yeah. Y'all, Mari been doing his big one. He's been doing so good. Hey, it's one of yellow. Ooh, it smells delicious. Thank you. Look at that. He understands the content, guys. We get angles. <laughs> Gotta get them angles. Gotta get the angles. This right here, though? Oh my God, that smells delicious. Yeah. You doing your big one, huh? We're gonna give him a rating, guys, at the end. Tell me what you think about his selection so far. We are due for another drink. I killed that. Oh, 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 we do, we have to do a fit check. We do have to do a fit check. Okay. A little razzle dazzle. So this is like the fish sauce. Get us right now. Okay. Killing me with the pinky. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, slap. And now we have some Thai tea. Nice. Thai calamari. Calamari with Omari. <laughs> How special. How special. Our table looks so good, y'all. Give Amari 10 out of 10 from the drinks to the 
food, to the vibes, to the aesthetic. He says we have more stuff to see, so. 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10 though. Well, I guess that's bragging, right? You can brag about that. Uh, I don't even care. <laughs> Let things talk for themselves. <laughs> I'm full. We have a bag of stuff because <laughs> we ain't eat everything. Let's see where we go next. I mean, tell us, talk, talk to me. Tell me where we at. So, uh, this location is a historic. <laughs> <laughs> it's called Pit Top Village. You know, little vibe area with the overlooking city. Look at the tree. All the good stuff. All the good stuff is gorgeous. Here, this big ass mansion. Something so prestigious. Back in like the 1800s or something like that, and uh, now it's just unoccupied. A tourist area. Um, be up here too. Yeah. Yeah, because the sun is setting. Look what you see how you did that? I like how you did that. Perfect timing. Immaculate timing. Immaculate timing for an immaculate location. Uh, immaculate. After an immaculate meal, you're absolutely right. Cause I'm still, you did y'all. I'm very proud. I'm very proud. That's right. Y'all gonna see this you at the same time as me because I'm just gonna keep recording. <laughs> y'all aren't even seeing what I'm seeing. Like <laughs> Do y'all see this? Look at the mountain back there. Like, I cannot make this up. Look what God made. This view is absolutely stunning. Like, it is absolutely stunning. I keep getting emotional. I don't know why. I think this trip has just been monumental within itself and then being able to bring it to an end or bring it to a head with this amazing day and this scenery. It's okay if I cry, I feel like. It's okay, I can cry, I can cry. Happy tears, because they're tears of happiness for real, like, wow. It's like we go from scenery to scenery. We're not going there, okay. We're not going there. We're not, okay, good. Oh no, whoa, whoa, look at that. Insane, is it black owned? No, of course it's not. I forgot where we were, I'm sorry. So, I don't know where we're going for dessert, but. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine, everything has been fine. Y'all, how he, wow, well, rate him, how he doing so far? Let me know, let me know, let me know, let me know. Everything has just been so cute. <laughs> Like, so cute. You didn't even tell me we were like coming up on it. Thank you. So we are going for the apricot white velvet and then what was the other one? German chocolate. Where is that on here? German chocolate cake, okay. Apricot? No, we're not doing it that way. But we are gonna taste it. Alright, we can do that. One taste it. Have you guys ever been on a date that just totally blew you away without having any expectation of it ever happening? That was this for me, and I'm just so happy that I said yes. I had an amazing time. Comment below what you think this date was because I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. But this is how I spent my last day in Portland. I had to be at the airport at 4 a.m. the next morning for a 6 a.m. flight. But your girl was flying first class, so I had mimosas and breakfast. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe to my channel.